Hello, welcome to Yates Makes. I'm back with more jelly plate printing. This thing is extremely addictive. Um, today I'm using it just to mess around really with sketchbook ideas, using the jelly plate amongst collage, mixed media work as a base layer for some observational drawing. Okay. I love observational work, but sometimes it's nice just to be working over the top of a, a surface, a collage, something just to make the whole process a little more interesting. So the idea here was to build up a bit of a mixed media kind of pop themed background to do my observational drawing on. So I've done a bit of, um, I've done a little rollered impression of some Lego bricks. I've now um, done my first jelly plate transfer left that weight on for two minutes and there you can see my photograph from a glossy magazine of I think Joni Mitchell's face there has transferred quite nicely duplicating some tissue paper dots nice big ones <clears throat> to really kind of dominate that left hand side sticking those on with some acrylic gel medium put a bit down first and then brush over the top as well more jelly plate work, this time transferring some text. So you can see, you'll have to experiment with different types of magazines, papers, but you know, a lot of magazines will work. Now this is a discovery I've made recently, where if you use Electroset, this works beautifully as a transfer with the jelly plate, as you'll see now. Okay, a bit more roller work with some acrylic and the Lego bricks get a kind of dot pattern bit more colour and collage work on the right hand side and now I'm going to start sketching in my kind of object I'm going with the pop art theme of an everyday object um, so I've chosen a, a little safety pin and starting to think how I might add one more collage piece on the end of that pin like a little explosion or something um, kind of along the pop theme so yeah just all I'm doing here is just Sketching in some of my darker tones with the biro, a bit of cross hatching, building up a bit of tonal variation. Um, nice to work with biro, nice to work in a kind of graphic way over the top of all that kind of textured, collage, kind of messier background. It gives you a nice contrast. So, once I've done my Tonal work in, in black, my darker tones. I'm then going to go in with some white acrylic, add some highlights, which is what you'll see me doing next. Um, and following the, the acrylic work, I went in with a Posca pen just to get some sharper highlights, which is what you'll see me doing in a second. Um, but you can see there's a nice close up actually, just how well, even with lighter colours like the pink and the blue um, blend I've got across that photo transfer the jelly plate transfers photographs as long as you found the right paper um, obviously glossy magazines seem to work pretty well um, but I've tried all sorts and a lot of things work well it seems more about the amount of pressure the amount of ink seems or the amount of acrylic paint should I say that you use seems more important like I said before, it's really going to be trial and error that helps you work out what acrylics, what amount of acrylic, what amount of pressure and what papers work best. And also the tonal values of the picture. The higher the contrast I find in the picture you're, you're trying to transfer, the better the transfer will be. Okay, last few touches now. Added a little kind of orange explosion, a bit of movement with some pro markers and sort of a bit of a pop, literal pop theme there that I've added in. Um, last few touches and yeah, there you go. Job done. And as I said before, always looking for ways to have a play around, make some new discoveries in mixed media and add a bit of excitement to me observational drawing practice at the same time. There you go, hope you enjoyed the video. Hope it's given you a few ideas. Um, seriously, get hold of one of these things, the world looks a little different. Everything you see, you start wondering if you can transfer it, print off it, whatever. They're a lot of fun. 
uh, as long as you look after them uh, they should last you a while remember if you liked the video please like subscribe share comment below look forward to seeing you soon in another video take it easy bye bye